வணக்கம் மே ஹைதர் அலி சையத் ஆசிர்வாதம் சே யுனைடெட் அண்ட் தமிழ் சேவா இஸ் இஸ்லாம் இஸ்லாம் இஸ் எ காட் கைடட் பாத் அண்ட் எ சிஸ்டம் ஆஃப் அட்மினிஸ்ட்ரேஷன் ஃபார் மேன் கைண்ட் so one can have good in this world and good in the hereafter isn't did god teach islam the system by which one can achieve good in this world and good in the hereafter was taught in written form to one of the sons of adam giving him information on all subjects and knowledge of preservation and destruction see quran chapter 96 verses 1 to 7 what is the declaration of islam the declaration or shahada or kalima of islam is as follows god is one and his appointed khalifa in succession the god's representative on earth is the keeper of balance and justice among god's creations on earth assisted by angels refer to quran chapter 3 verse 18 who are the kumri people kumri people are the senior generation The first people on earth to live in the cradle of civilization were called Kumari Kandam. People staying there are known as Kumri people. Their language is Tamil. Do Kumri people recite the same Kalima Shahada as reminded in Quran chapter 3 verse 18? The Kalima Shahada of the Kumri people is Sivam Sivan. Sivam in Tamil means God omnipotent and Sivan in Tamil means God representative on earth. Sivan translated into Arabic means khalifa kalima mentioned in Quran chapter 3 verse 18 is reminding the kumri people who is the khalifa or sivan on earth sivan means god's representative on earth sivan translated into arabic means khalifa as per tamil tradition pandian established the first sangam at kumari kandam what is the arabic name for the pandians The Arabic term for the Pandians is Dhulkarnain. How can you say Pandian and Dhulkarnain are the same? Dhulkarnain means two horns. Two horns refers to the bull. Pandian symbol is the bull. Dhulkarnain means king of two generations. That is, they are the appointed kings. Before and after Noah's flood, Pandian king of Kumari Kandam and after the deluge also. Pandian in Arabic means dhulkarnain. Welcome. Thank you.